truck over here towards turn number one. A lot going on here, so it's tough to grab guys for actual interviews, but we're figuring we'd get some of the cars and catch some of the guys along the way. It's all soil fried. Is this him right here coming up? No. No? Okay. Dalton, oh, I'm trying to get you, buddy. Haven't been able to do it so far, though, so. Blue the Bay Juniors ride here. Some of these aren't the coolest looking race cars you ever saw, huh? Are we done, Lou? Yeah, we lost the set of the injection stacks, so it's not worth getting the dirt down in the motor and everything like that. Okay. Is that an easy fix or just yeah, something we can't do here? Just got to locate some, that's all. Oh, you can't find them right now, that's no, the problem. Come off the car down to three and four and probably went over the outside fence. So Seriously? Yeah. yeah. I front injection stacks there, so. It wow. Happens. I guess I didn't know that that was something that actually happened. Oh, yeah. So, just wasn't tightened enough, or? Yeah, I don't know. We uh, looked at it before we went out, and it just wind caught it right, and it took it off the top of the motor. So. Okay. How was the car before all that happened? Uh, we just made a couple of changes. We're on really old tires, so it wasn't great the first session. Um, seemed to be coming around that second session. It was quick and tense off every lap, and it flew off. So. so, even though we did have the problem with the stack, it sounds like we at least learned something today, right? We have yeah. nothing major we need to work on, right? No, we shook the car down. Nothing's, you know, nothing's broke. The motor's running good and strong. We got the fuel system where we need to be. So, um, now we'll go to the opener with some new tires and see how it rolls. You gonna do the fast ride, or did we learn enough today where we can skip that and just race Saturday for real? We've been pretty comfortable with this car since you know since we put the independent on it. We end and know where it's gonna be. So. Um, today was just a little playing around, trying to do stuff. But I think we'll just run it Saturday and see where we're at. Now, what we're going to do, everybody talking about, you guys are in dirt. You know, there's no straight front axle. That's an independent suspension. When did we switch to that? Uh, so, we bought the car. We ran it for 16, 17, I think 18. So, I think we ran it in uh, 2019. And then last year with the independent, so we've got a couple of years with that. All right. Good to see you, man. And uh, hopefully nothing flies off the car next week. Good yeah, job, hopefully man. Not. Thank you very much, sir. We'll keep moving here and see who else we might be able to run into. Because we're having fun up here. Canada will rain down a little after one, so I said, what the heck, let's hit the road. Of course, you know me, I never get to go up here as much as I would have liked. So Brian Sobis. Right, I had a little audio issue with that last clip I did, so I got to ditch you again. Sorry about that. How's the day going so far? Pretty good. I've uh, been out on the track a couple times, made some gains. Um, speed's halfway decent, but uh, without putting new tires on, I think we're about maxed out. Okay. Ready? Just one more session, two more? What are you thinking? Uh, we made a couple little changes, so we're going to go out and do one more session. If it feels better and goes as fast as it did the last time, I think it's a good move, but I don't necessarily think we're really going to pick up a lot of speed. Okay. Good job, man. I'll talk to you soon. Thank you. Brian Zobis going out at least one more time. See what happens here. This is the Dan Connors Jr. 01. Of course, we've had him on the page a couple of times. And no, I can't go in the holler and show you right now because he's uh, getting dressed. Looks like he's done for the day, so... Let's see what John Coloca says here before we shut this particular clip off. And go excuse, down. Excuse me, John, are we done for the day? No. Oh, okay, I oh, saw no. him change it in there. I thought maybe we were done. That wasn't, that wasn't Russell. No, no, no. I was talking about here with Dan. Oh, no, we, we got until 5 o'clock. Okay, going to use it all. Okay, all right. Oh, go ahead, sir, I'm sorry. And look later in the week, John's going to show us some inside motor stuff, so make sure to come back from that. Thanks, John. You're welcome. Jack Patrick. Just getting out of his ride. Man, you look you look pretty tired. How are you? It's been a long day so far, but we're gaining on it a little bit at a time. We what are we working on? Four small problems. We had uh, four small problems. Yeah, just some alignment issues with the belts and uh, and brake calipers, but okay, we're getting them. That's why we practice, right? Right. How, how's that? How does the car feel? It felt good. That was the first time out, so all right. We'll practice good. on it a little bit longer, and then we'll be. 
good for next week. Hopefully. And he's hoping for a rule change where he can run a Mopar somewhere well, down the road. Right. Good to see you, Jack. Have Thanks. fun today, okay? Ryan Sobis is ready to go out, so they're going to push him off here. Fifty super. 